Now, Luto comes to When I got Ward walks. Yeah, so basically I go out with her. Am I going over there then? Slightly when we did something, do it. I think it's a musical. I've got one team two, one thing too many. Front rank. Left. Without. Yes. Without intervals. Ball. Right. I'm loving it there. Too easy to shop. <laughs> No, no, can't hear you. Still can't hear you. Can't hear you. Tip it down just a slight way. Just tip it towards it. Yeah. <laughs> we'll make it better. Will you make it up? A method of doing it, we could do it. Yeah, it Dennis! Dennis Bailey! Shit! Kevin! Standards! Have you seen the relatives of the crew? What are they to come with you, Colonel? <laughs> We've got two bit of replayers and everybody else will fall out. Yeah. Welcome to this act of remembrance for the crew of 10 servicemen of the United States Air Force Flight B-17 Miami, who lost their lives 80 years ago on the 22nd of February 1944 here in Encliffe Park. We gather now to remember their life and lay wreaths as an act of remembrance. Let us pray. O oh God, our refuge and our strength, an ever-present help in times of trouble, we give thanks for the lives of those who were lost in Encliffe Park. Staff Sergeant Harry W. Hester Brooks, Engineer, Top Tower Gunner. Staff Sergeant Robert E. Mayfield, Radio Operator. Sergeant Vito R. Ambrosio, Right Waist Gunner. Sergeant Morris B. Robbins, Trail Gunner. Sergeant Charles H. Puffle, Ball Tower Gunner.
in faith and love, defend you on every side, and guide you in truth and peace. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Amen. Parade, stand at ease. Forced down by bad clouds, skimming our roof up on its last fateful turn after the crash of an engine. The family were obviously talking about it. I went outside, aged four, and saw a huge plume of smoke stretching across the sky. So, to me, it's annual remembrance. This is, of course, the 80th um, remembrance service. It's very special to me. You and to the people of Sheffield, by, by the looks of things, a good turnout today. People in Sheffield won't forget, will they? No, and we always get a good turn out of So you must be a very proud man today. I have. I need to go to be organised and think. And uh, what a beautiful service and ceremony. Well, well organised, all of you. Well, I'm a little bit old for this. Well, you, you, don't look it. you don't look no, it, you I think you did well. very well. Uh, 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 yeah. You didn't muck your words once. Well. Yeah, the Reverend Ella was working to an old draft of right. a quarter yeah. Yeah. Are you, Did you fly across the sea? No, no, I don't. Adam does. Sorry. So I'm representing Adam over here. Yeah, but your accent, where are you? Cape Town. Oh, yeah, 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 I yeah, nearly yeah. got it. I'm not that deaf. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's great to see you here. Thank you very much. Thank you. Adam, Adam would have wanted to be here. Yeah, I think he would have appreciated yeah. this. Yeah. Tell him I, I did some flying out of Lakeland, Florida. Okay. Uh, and dipped my toes in the Gulf of Tampa Bay. Oh, <laughs> wonderful. I'll tell him. We learn everything through other stories and the people tell us about Maya and um, books that are read and that's what's brought most of our knowledge and stuff. We read the books like everybody else and that's how we learn about him. Um, and it, you know, it's interesting to learn more about the Craig Houser's family too and that they have a similar kind of story and I'm curious to know more about other families and what, how much they know or don't know and whether it's the same or it was from the hurt because Grandma Irma, you can look at him, she loved Lyle so much. And she was so angry that he died. That the anger. You know, it just brings so much peace and joy to all of us. So we appreciate it. This was a really cool experience. Just talking to locals and learning about their knowledge of it, coming every year or whatever. And I didn't realize how big this ceremony is every year. I thought it was on the 75th anniversary and the 80th anniversary. It was a big deal now, but I didn't realize that every year they have such a great ceremony and stuff. And, um, you know, how many other families don't get this honor? It's a, it's a great honor for us, I feel like, because yes, they were heroes in what they did in, in avoiding the children. And that is a great honor for us. But there's so many other men that died that day, many of the war days. So um, they do. And so we're grateful for we get this honor, but we're also, you know, lest we forget, it's honoring more than just our crew members, and that that's pretty cool to me too. I think. Thank you. Yes.
bodies have been given and taken away. We particularly remember today hopes of righteousness, the planting of the Lord to display His glory. They shall build up the ancient ruins, they shall raise up the former devastations, they shall Banner flag once. Mm. Scout, and that's about as far as I got. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we weren't quite as smart or as precise. It's very nice. <laughs> <laughs>
Shuck Hill um, in, in honor of the Creek Houser family.